Hello, I'm going to make a, an animation of uh, two hockey sticks um, passing a puck back and forth. And this will be part one, we'll, we'll just create the hockey stick. And then part two video series will make the animation part that we can render into video. Um, so I'm going to start with a new uh, Blender file. And I'm going to use the scale tool to scale it down. You can also press S to scale. And I want to make it taller. About that size. And I'm going to rotate it at the beginning so it's had a bit of an angle like this. Then I'm going to go into edit mode and select with the face selection. I'm going to zoom in on that. I'm going to press numpad a decimal to zoom in close, or you could move around with the hand tool. And with the face selected, I'm going to go to extrude, extrude a little bit, and then scale a little bit just to make a bit of a bigger end. And then I'm going to extrude again. I'm just pressing E to extrude. Um, undo E to extrude. And then E to extrude again. And scale this part down to give a nice end. Then down at the bottom of the stick, I want to select the bottom part and I'm going to press numpad decimal again to zoom in to that region. And here I want to um, extrude down again. And this time I'm going to scale it. So it's just skinnier. And I'm going to look at it from the side. Here I'm going to extrude again. And then I'm going to rotate. I'm pressing R to rotate, G to grab. Um, you could also use these tools to rotate and move parts. E to extrude, R to rotate, G to grab, rotate. And E to extrude, G, rotate. I'm going to go back to, um, okay, yeah, so I can see if I look straight on, I can tell what uh, the horizontal should look like. And I'm on track here, so I'm going to extrude a bit more. And then I'm going to extrude a bit more and scale that down. Okay, there is a, a basic hockey stick. You could do more. You could um, add more vertices and shape it and bend it a bit. I'm going to add some color to it just so it has <clears throat> some different colors. The first color that I add is going to go to everything. So I'm going to say new material, I'll pick uh, a beige color. If I switch to shading options, I should see that color. Then if I sh go to wireframe and uh, I should be able to select, um, if I use select box, I could select these pieces and add a new material. New, make this black and put tape, and then click assign. So the second piece got a different color than the first piece. If I go back to shading, I can see that uh, that part is a different color. And I could do the same at the top here. I could 
select with the box, or I could press C to circle select, and press E to deselect everything. Go to wireframes, like it goes through. And then I just want to assign the second material to that selection. And there we have it. There's a hockey stick, sort of. Okay. Um, part two will animate two hockey sticks um, and pass a puck back and forth.